I support my United. For United? Yeah. yeah. No, it must have broke your heart during the season. No, it didn't break my heart, but I support my United. Is it good, bro? Yeah, yeah, can you hear me, yeah? Yeah, I can hear you, I can hear you. What are you saying, bro? You good? Yeah, all cool, bro. My name's Noel Hyle. Grew up in Holland. Started football there. I was born in Holland, and that's where it all started. When did you move to, obviously, England? When I was 10. 10? Yeah, so 10, go, yeah, 10, yeah, 10, 10, 10. You you were United when you it was round twenty. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, that, I moved over and then I, I signed for United. Yeah, that's that's mad. So how did that come about? Uh, we played in a tournament. Uh, we was the my team was the local team in the tournament, and then we played some English teams, Liverpool and so. And I scored. I did well, and then I got scouted from there, and then I moved over. United twenty fifteen, and then. Correct me if I'm wrong. City a year after. Yeah, a year and a half we went to City. Yeah. How, yeah. how, how, how did that work out? Because obviously they're rivals. I played City a couple of times. I did well, I think. And then it must have been watching me for for quite a while. So they asked me to do it the first time, and I said no because I just didn't want to leave straight away at United. And then they asked me to join the season after, halfway through. And then I came, and then I said, yeah. And then I said, I would drive. Obviously, being at both Manchester clubs, were you saying, like, which one did you like more? Yeah, Man City was better. How come to it? What was it like? Man City, I think you, maybe not now, but in definitely three, four years ago, maybe five years ago now, mm. in that time, uh, City way ahead in that academy football. And... I think improve much more there, so no. And see, he's good, good players, playing with good players all around. So, yeah, de definitely see. Saying that, who who do you think is the best player you played with in your career so far? Would be Mason when I was at United. What Greenwood? Yeah, 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 he's crazy. Crazy, isn't it? Yeah, Mason's crazy. Ability is crazy. Both feet strong, fast, finishing is crazy. Yeah. What's the standout attribute that he had? He's finishing. Of both of you, it's crazy. He doesn't miss. You went from United to City to then going abroad, turning down a contract from City. How did that come about? Because that's not something like. Yeah, so got offered one of the three at City and then just weighed up my options and thought where long term would be best for me to try have a realistic chance to break through in the first team. And I had some offers from abroad, from other good clubs as well. But I thought Leipzig came with like the best plan, and and I thought realistic chance to play first team at a good age. And so far, so good. I think first half of the season was hard, just to trying to learn it. But now it's going well. And I'm happy I'm there, so it's good. Well, what's what's the difference? What's like the biggest difference from playing football in England to playing football out there? The standard like players in England, it's easy to play with your team. Because like most of the players are all very, very good. Yeah. Whereas in Germany, you might have to do a bit more for yourself and like make stuff happen for yourself. Because that city, it's like sometimes you don't even have to play well, but you can score free because of the players around you. Just put the ball yeah, in there. Cool. Whereas in Germany, it's like different. Players might not be at the same quality as you. So you're going to have to do more and show yourself more. And there's a bit more pressure on you because like you're like the big guy coming from another club as well, yeah. which is normal. But that, that would be the main difference, I'd say. First, first half of the season, I struggled a bit. It was, it was quite hard, being away from family as well and new language and so, so and I got injured as well in the first half of the season. So yeah, that, that set me back as well. So I missed like what three months. Yeah, I, with MCO on the side. Uh, what, me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but after Christmas, it was all good. So no, so far I'm happy now. So obviously you played for for both Netherlands and. England, yeah, national level. 
obviously in, in coming years there's going to be bad debate on who you're going to choose and yeah, yeah, yeah. Them. what's it like for playing both of them it's a bit different in what sense England's just full of ballers isn't it England's yeah right, no, it's bit, is, I think, yeah it's a bit different I personally enjoy playing for a lot mm. how comes maybe it suits a bit my game more yeah England England's very good though like when they play this top and this I think England is good you got high level of uh, competition for places so yeah. if you're in there you know you know you're doing well yeah no but England top side so. most English players are making that jump from England to Germany or England to abroad yeah where, where do you think that all came from like who, who do you think started that trend probably the main one was Jada yeah because it worked, it worked out very well for him. But I think you have to remember, not everybody's Jaden. So you got to do what's best for you. It's true. Not everybody can go to a club and maybe struggle first half of the season and then do what he's doing. Not everybody yeah. has the quality like Jaden. So I think you have to do what's best for you. And if it's if it's the right club with the right plan, then you got to try it out. What are you saying? Do you think, oh. do you, think you made the right decision going over there? Yeah, so far it's cool. I don't, I don't really get anything. Trying to reach the highest level as, as possible as I can. Score a lot of goals. Yeah. Play Champions League. So I'm trying to do. Just become a big player. So I know. Um, what, team, what team do you support? Because I'm seeing a couple of comments asking. I support my United. For United? Yeah. yeah. Well, it must have broke your heart joining City then. No, it didn't break my heart, but I support my United. Mad. And you just, just joined City like that? Yeah, it was the best for my career. It doesn't really add. The supporting team is a bit, it's a bit yeah, BS nah, it's because true, true. you have to do what's best for your career, not who you support. So what have you been doing to keep fit? Uh, yeah, we've got our programs. Uh, right. We've got off-season programs, like stuff that you can do at home that you don't need weights for. And mm. obviously go on runs most yeah. days. So, obviously, you keep fit. But, Are yeah. you struggling though? Because obviously it's, it's not the same as training. It's not the same as training, so it's a bit dry, like it's so repetitive. So, but you gotta do it anyway. So, but what's next for you? Trying to do as well at my club. Mm. Uh, oh well, yeah. This season's been a bit hard, but next season, just try and be with the first team as much as I can. And, and have you have you been involved in the first team recently in terms of that training and stuff? Yeah, a little, little bit, little bit. Not as much as I would have liked. Well, what's, bit, what's, what's the standard like from obviously jumping 18s, 23s to first in straight? Just faster, I think. Just much sharper, but not as much as I would have liked to be with them. But well, it's coming. I'm not. I'm not really worried about that. It's coming. So I think more next season, and we kick off from there. But in terms of music, who are you following right now? Music. I like. Most that really rich, yeah. Little baby's new album, Fire Top. If you can make a, a five aside team, yeah, with the best players you've played with, who would it be? And I'm your saying. gaffer, your gaffer, so you're not allowed to be in it. No, I'm not allowed to be in it. I'd put CJ, Lee Bellingham, Mason, Divine from Ajax, Nacho Noah, yeah. I, um, just a quick one. I beg you back off the hat. Let me see the trip. Oh, no, no, I can't. Let me see the trip. Let me see the trip, but I don't know. Trip for. Hey, struggling, isn't it? Got you. Go on, back off, back off. Sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, go on. Put it back on, put it back on. It's all right. It could nah, get worse, but. I'm yeah. seeing someone Stop. say, if Noah replies, I'll shave my head. Harrison Hurst. I saw that. Make sure you do it, mate. Harrison. <laughs> No, it's been good to chat. It's been good to get to know you. No, uh, we'll keep in touch. Yeah, cool. And thank you for everyone watching. No worries, mate. See ya. Ciao. Yeah.